only get out parking tickets with this accent, so. Oh, because you act like you don't know He's what you're like, doing? I don't know. I'm a foreigner. Help me. Oh my God. I'm going to start mimicking you if we keep talking yeah. right now. I'm cool. That was not cool. <laughs> that wasn't cool, was it? The gun's just not cool. <laughs> Cut that one out. Welcome to Happy Adorning. This is where we feature real women doing rad stuff. Today we are with Miss Jennifer Veal. Hey! Thanks for coming to visit us. Thanks for having me. Well, if you don't already know Jennifer, she is a YouTuber, an actress, a super hilarious human. Thanks for adding that in. I did oh, tell man. her to say that. <laughs> I did. Can you tell us a little bit about what it is that you do? Like, what's your, what's your day look like? My day is a little bit crazy. Yeah, I get up, I shoot, I try and see what the world is all about and what women and lifestyle is all about. And I shoot and try and make people laugh. It's a bit scary, to be honest. Well, you're making Getting yourself really vulnerable. Yeah, people either like you or they hate you. Yeah. I hope that I'm a good influence, because I don't think there's enough I out there. I think you there. are. I like to bring good, happy energy to the internet world. That's fantastic. Yeah. We love that here at the Happy Adorning. Good, Yay. I like uh, it too. <laughs> <laughs> so I noticed uh, on some of your videos on YouTube that you do a bit of cooking. I'm a secret wannabe housewife. Hi there, housewives, and welcome to Tiny Cook. The first item we're going to be making is creepy edible worms. Ooh. So today we're going to be making. Oops. I like eating healthy and I like cooking and I like celebrating people and having people over. So I thought, why don't I cook more and hope that people can see that you can do what I'm cooking as well because it's sometimes I have disasters in the kitchen. Add a little pep, little salt. Oh shit but it works out eventually. We all do. So you got your start in acting, mm -hmm. how? I um, was very, very young and I was in like a department store with my mum and my elder brother, Tom, and I went missing. Yeah, I know, dramatic. <laughs> my mum was crying around the shop and then she was like, oh, where is she? I'm gonna have one last look outside. Goes running outside. That's like the dramatic mum fall. She's not gonna like me saying that. <laughs> and then she sees me stood in the store window like a mannequin. <gasps> so she's like, <laughs> She's like, get out of the window. And that's where my mum and dad were like, yeah, she uh, clearly yeah. needs the attention. So the 15 year old you, yes. would you give that 15 year old you any advice? I think the only advice that I would give myself is not to care so much about what people think about your image. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? Because I feel like nowadays, social media is so crazy. That's what I try and portray from my channel is that I am me, I go on there with no makeup, I go on there looking great and looking like I've just woke up. And it, actually, I just woke up like this on there, seriously. And um, that's okay. And I wish that I could tell myself that that was okay then. Because people love you for you and yes. that's how it should be. 15 year olds, we'll listen you. to that. <laughs> Before your happy adorning earrings. Oh, yeah. Can we do a zoom on those? Ha ha. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. That's great. <laughs> what other piece of adornment do you have that you love that you wear all the time? This ring. Uh, my oh, boyfriend this... got me this ring. Oh, and um, it was the first piece of jewelry and I've never taken it off. And if you look at it, it's like a wish ring. It's bent like a wishbone. Oh, that's so cute. Yeah, and it's like you supposedly close your eyes and make a little wish. And oh, that's you know, really sweet. Good job. In terms of advice that you would give to maybe young girls or uh, your fans, mm -hmm. anything that you've learned along the way in this process? That everybody is different and we don't all have to try and conform to be like somebody who's in the public eye or someone that's cool at school or anything like that. I just think that it's such a cool, amazing, beautiful thing that nobody is like you. Being unique is definite tick for me. Yeah. I'm just a big believer of genuinely being yourself because I just don't think enough women are like that. And I, and my channel, I like to just inspire women to be themselves and that, so, you know, don't try and change yourself for a boy or whoever you want to impress just because someone and people in the world love and appreciate you somewhere. Yeah, and, and they that's, should. that's what I get from watching your videos is that you are just so honestly you. I am. Every second. I just embraced myself and who I am and what I thought people would want to hear and listen to and what I wanted 
say, my younger sister to watch. Right. Because there's also like a fine line on YouTube of things being a little bit crazy and then like parents not wanting them to watch it. And I wanted yeah. to be that cool medium yeah. for like teenage girls and whatever to watch. Yeah. So, yeah. Because you got to have the cool factor. Well, thank you so much for being here. Thank you for having me. I'm so excited yeah. that you're home. <laughs> no, for it's... sure. I'm just like grazing you with my enormous hat. It's not that big. So subscribe to your channel, of yeah, course. And subscribe to this channel. Because it's Happy fun. adorning! Yay. And your um, Instagram and Twitter is all Just at, at Jennifer, Jennifer Beal. Beal. That's me. I have Jenny beanies coming out. Are they pink with little pom poms? It's called the boobs beanie, mm -hmm. and fifteen percent of every hat sold goes to cancer research. So. Oh, that's fantastic! I'm yeah. Okay. You'll find. Me. Go follow her. Thanks, guys. Thanks. See you soon. Bye.